All right, y'all, welcome back to another video. How's your bay over here? And I'm here at the gym once again. And today I'm gonna be showing you guys nice leg routine you guys can do using only dumbbells. So you guys can do this at a gym or even at your home. You just invest in some dumbbells and that's all you need. So let's get into the very first exercise. All right, y'all, so this workout is gonna involve your quads, hamstrings, glutes, and a little bit of catch. So first we're gonna be starting out with Romanian deadlifts. Yeah, Romanian deadlifts. You gotta involve your glutes and your hamstrings. For this one, you can go heavy. So you just wanna be careful you don't put a lot of uh, stress on your back. So if you wanna pretend or imagine pushing your hips back like this, and you just come down. So you feel the stretch, and you come up, stretch your hips while pushing your hips back. So when you're doing this exercise, you guys want to think as if you're pushing your ass all the way back whenever you come up, or whenever you come down. And then whenever you come up, you thrust up, but you want to be keeping a little bit of a bend on your knee. Right, so the next exercise we're going to be doing is going to be Bulgarian split squats. So for this one, all you're going to need is some dumbbells and the bench. And now for this one, you can either make it work your glutes and your hamstrings or your quads, depending on your on your foot position. So you're gonna to wanna to put one one foot on the bench, and if you take a big step forward, or your leg, whenever you come down, your legs even. It's gonna focus on your glutes. And if you come closer to the bench, you have more uh, knee knee flexor, knee flexibility, and it comes forward in front of your toes, it's gonna to be more of your quads. So depending on what you want to hit, I'm gonna be doing it for my quads. So let's go for 10 to 12 reps. All right, so for this one, you guys are going to want to thrust your hips onto the bench because the more your glutes are outwards, more pointed out, the more stress it takes away from your hamstrings and the more it puts it on your lower back. And then at that point, you're not doing the exercise right. So you want to focus on pressing your hips up against the bench and then just scooping up the dumbbell with your feet and it just takes time getting used to it. Superseted with wide dumbbell squats. So for this one, it's gonna be mostly quad dominant because whenever you come down, your knee goes in front of your foot, and then when superseted with wide stand squats, it's gonna be more of your hamstrings than your glutes. So ideally for this exercise, you guys would use a ramp, but if you guys don't have one, all you could use, like how I did, is a pair of dumbbells. You can put like five 10 pound dumbbells, only like about two inches elevated, so you could get more of your quads activated whenever you squat. Alright, Super simple. Watch that squat. Oh. Alright y'all, so for this 
next exercise is the second to last one. Three. We're gonna be drop sitting it, but the first set we're gonna be going as heavy as possible. The last one's gonna be body weight. So you guys wanna make sure you guys have a lot of walking space. It's gonna be walking lunges. So you guys wanna make sure you got enough space, or if not, you just go backwards or just go on and then just standing still. But I'm gonna be going as heavy as possible. Since my upper body can do 50 pound dumbbells on each side, I'm going to be doing 50 pound dumbbells too for my lower body. So. Uh, this one's going to kill. That's what we want. This is straight to it. Tomorrow. Tomorrow.